Whoa! 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 Little Thor, where are you going? Thor is here! Look at that little guy go. Yeah, he's eager to go ahead and start killing monsters, and so are we. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the joy of le Can you please stop? Can't you see I'm making an intro here? Oh dear. I'm gonna turn you into a toaster oven at some point. Alright, so, as I was saying, welcome back everyone to the joy of leveling, and we are back in World of Warcraft, leveling a warrior, right now level 47, can you believe it? And we've got 150% arrested XP almost, and we'll use that to hopefully level very very fast, and uh, maybe make it to 60, but I think like more 54, 55 is more realistic. For now, we shall go ahead and slay Plaguehounds. Lots and lots of Plaguehounds. Boom. Oh, we need their blood. Um, we do have a battle shot now, I think. Yes, we do. We also have Berserker Rage. And Berserker Rage is right, right important for warriors because this is one of the amazing skills that allows you to break effects like Fear, Sap and other incapacitate effects. Alrighty. Other than that, I think we have everything we need. So let's go ahead and kill some Plaguehounds. Uh, we also do have Heroic Leap, which is perfect, so we can just charge around in between these guys. Let's see if I can still play with my warrior. Ah, this is not looking too bad. Execute. Boom. Boom. Okay. We can still play the warrior. That's good. The music in Eastern Plaguelands is a tad bit depressing, don't you guys think? Just a teeny bit depressing. Do we already have deep wounds, by the way? And did I get my talents? Okay, we got massacre. Okay, but uh, where is? Oh, deep wounds only at level seventy-eight. Oh, that's a little ways off. But it's also okay. We can't do that. You have to be in war mode for that. Okay, never mind. I said nothing, and I am saying the exact opposite now. <laughs> oh dear. So, yeah, with this um, rest XP, we should be able to get to, I think, I think 54 is a somewhat realistic target. Let's see if we can actually hit it. I've been doing a lot of DPS lately in our raids as an uh, arms warrior, so that should help me level a little bit faster. All the skills I learned at slicing and dicing the enemy. Slice, we dice, we chop them to bits. Uh, I hate those carrying grubs, those are. I don't know. Uh, some of these grubs are actually edible. Not in World of Warcraft, but in real life. Not in Germany, though. You don't get those. Um, what are they called in the, the US and Canada? Witchy grubs or something like that? Yep. Not a fan. Not a fan. <laughs> Yeah, victory rush is keeping us nice and healthy, which is really important. And three more bloods and we should be done in this first zone here. Whatever the music artist for this uh, area of the game was doing, he clearly went for ominous and creepy and uh, gargoyles. I don't want a gargoyle, I want to have a blackhound here. And one more. Okay. Can never have enough play counts. I wish that Thor would add some damage. That would be nice. And I wonder if you just see um, numbers pop up really. I set my mixed scoring battle text so it only shows damage numbers above 500. Because I don't care about the stuff below that. We'll get to a point where everything we do goes over 500. Boom, there we go. That is enough wolf meat. Uh, or plague hound meat. I mean, I don't know why I would want plague hound meat, but maybe. Maybe there is a connoisseur out there that can tell us that plague hound meat just tastes a lot better because it has been slightly pre-digested by all those uh, effects of um, decomposition and whatnot. And it sounds exactly as ugly as I thought it would sound. Okay. Fiona. 
If Shrek comes around the corner, I'm gonna yell. I offer service with a smile. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we don't need that helmet, but that's fine. Um, okay. Then we can go this way, I think. Up the river to Gidvin Goldbraids. Actually, way over there. How do, how do I even get there? Is that still in Western Plaguelands? Um... Actually, you know what? I have no idea. When in doubt, just follow the river. And since we've established that I'm the second coming of Jesus in this character. See? Western Plaguelands, much friendlier music. Still a little bit of still a little bit of, um, of a musical note to it, as opposed to Eastern Plaguelands, which is just wom wom wom. <laughs> and here we go, Eastern Plaguelands again. So let's see. Let's see what we can find here. Okay, so we found a path at least. That's good. The entire soundtrack consists of four chords. <laughs> Okay, this is like a granary or something, an old farmhouse, and there should be a cave and somebody that is in a... Hi. Hello. Safe travels. Safe travels, alright. So I need to get um, some bile to get him out apparently. So we'll do that. I'll probably set the music to play um, non-continuously. Uh, let's let's not let's not loop the music because this is getting a little bit oppressive. <laughs> Only ten minutes in. Okay, we need crypt pile, and for that we probably need crypt slayers, which are these guys. So let's kill our merry way through them, shall we? Uh, space is very far apart. Okay, we'll just take these two of them. We were doing a um, heroic zoo yesterday, and the whole fight basically just felt like like all our melees jumping from one mob to the other. If you're not familiar with the boss encounter. Um, it's what in the new raid instance, Uldir, and uh, Zul is basically a uh, troll prophet that summons all sorts of minions to fight against us, and <laughs> you're just dashing from left to right, front to center, to the back. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. And we, we got like within an inch of killing him yesterday and then uh, we had to, to end the raid. Um, like literally the mob had 40k HP left. That's like one execute from me. Um, unfortunately I was dead at that time, so... <laughs> uh, close, but no cigar. That's okay. We'll, we'll probably kill him either uh, Thursday when the next raid is or um, next Tuesday. I'm gonna record that and uh, put these videos online, of course, as well. So, let's get our two more crypt bile. Kinda miss my Azerite power traits, and I really miss Warbreaker. Uh, when do we get Warbreaker, by the way? My Warbreaker Colossus Smash, it's, it's the untalented form. Level 50, wow, so that's only, that's only two and a half levels off. Well, a little bit more than two and a half levels. I am looking forward to that. I still wasn't lucky, by the way, in getting the quest to acquire the uh, strength experience ring, so we're still running the Signal of the Third Fleet, which is intended to be a mage ring, but I don't care. It's giving me 5% more experience. That's all I care about. As 5% doesn't sound like much, but in 120 levels, <laughs> that actually makes a few hours of difference. Okay, uh, we do have this stuff, so we can get back to him and turn in the quest, okay. Um, how do we get back to him, though? I think this way. Run like the wind! Kill little spider critters because we can, because we're evil. Blood for the blood god! Skulls for the skull throne and spiders for the... I don't know. Spider god? Spiders for Spider-Man? Ah, I kinda got lost in my train of thought there. It's okay. Yeah, once we're up to level 60, we're also gonna switch the transmog to something a little bit 
um, more outlandish because we're going to outland and we can finally do that. Do level 60 transmogs. Oh, it's gonna be glorious. Let's see, can I actually see my set items here? Yeah, yeah, okay. I, I love that 7th Legionnaire's Plate Armor. I'm, I'm really looking forward to getting that. So nice. So nice. What's on your okay, mind? here you go, Crypt Vile. Um, and then, hello? Okay, he's How out of there you? now. Now we need to get other stuff. Okay, we need to loot whatever that is. Banshee's Bells. From what? Okay. Okay, we shall we shall loot Banshee's Bells. I have no idea what Banshee's Bells are. It says we should loot them from the... Okay. Eh? Is that a Banshee's Bell? Oh, okay. So... We're looting... We're looting herbs, okay. Uh, too bad I don't have my magic angling gear. Magic fisherman's rod, that would be amazing. Huh? Um, where's the next one? Oh, this is gonna take a while. Yeah. Uh, okay, there's one more, and there's one more. Okay, luckily we can jump at least in water. It's a whole bunch around here. That's fine. Gotta take me a little bit of time to collect all these. And again, if they if they were to do this quest nowadays, um, there would be like three or more other quests here. Like you would be killing some monsters, maybe some fish or something. Um, it's funny you don't re you don't really recognize these differences until you play those old zones again, and you go like, hmm, yeah, they would do this and this, and that's unexpected. Very, very unexpected. I also blew my character 120 level boost yesterday. Finally caved in to uh, another 120, 110 boost. Finally caved in and leveled up my uh, Death Knight so that it can be Mythic Plus ready. Because the Warrior is a, is a is an okay tank for raids right now, but for Mythic Plus, um, there's a certain power level, a certain Mythic Plus level where Warrior starts to fall off a lot. Um, because it's, it's, it's just too weak right now, so I am going to be uh, tanking in our in our raids in Mythic Plus on a Death Knight for the next time being. I mean, Monk is also a really, really good tank, of course. Um, Demon Hunter as well, but uh, for Mythic Plus, Death Knight is just, brings just so much utility. Just the ability to just grab a mob and just pull them in, especially casters, is amazing. But for doing damage and for PvP and whatnot, I still prefer the good old warrior. Straight up in your face, you take a big axe, a big sword, or a big mace, and you bury it somewhere where the enemy doesn't like it. Um what am I doing here? Huh? What is this? Where, where am I supposed to go, by the way? Oh! So back to Fiona. Okay. Well. Um that makes a lot of sense. Okay. Okay, we're going back to Fiona. We're a little bit slow in our leveling speed right now, but that's okay. Um, let's see how much play time do I have on this level. Uh, 40 minutes because I've been logged in a little bit, checking the auction house and whatnot. Total time played, 15 hours so far to level 47. Mm -hmm. uh, even even in World of Warcraft, like basic leveling, there's so much time spent, uh, so much time you can have with leveling, having fun. Um, I don't know. People people complain about like the twelve bucks or so monthly subscription. For me, that's it's easily worth it. I mean, twelve bucks that's what you play for, for uh, pay for a movie for crying out loud, and that entertains you for two hours. So, How you know. Uh, okay, we got some gloves, and now we are going to board the caravan. Lucky charms. Okay, extra gold. Okay, perfect. Uh, hang on, hang on. What else can we get? Weapon oil. Extra holy damage. Okay, can we get that as well? Oh, you have to choose one. Okay, so holy damage, and this what does what? Uh. 
spells. No, no, we're right. We're good. So how are we going? Let's ride the caravan to its next destination. Preston and Argyle. And, uh... We're not shotgun. <laughs> we're anything but shotgun. With the rear guard. <laughs> he just calls shotgun. <laughs> and the big bad wolf is driving. That's a teeny bit weird. Look at nice detail on those wagon wheels. Uh, I like the rickety way it's driving. Wagon wheels aren't round though. Hey, look at these chests go up and down and, and open up. <laughs> <laughs> Stop laughing, that's creepy. Um, yeah, whoever did this did a really good job. I love this piece of, of uh, in-game artwork. Also funny that they have like, these little scratches in here from claws, potentially from her, because she forgot her, her key and you can't, she can't get in anymore, so she needs to claw her way in. Then she realizes that it has a, hand, has a handle and no keyhole, so you just open it. <laughs> hmm. Where the hell are we going? Ah, probably over here. <laughs> the Paladin Pals? That's what they call themselves? Oh dear. Ay, ay, ay. Hmm. I feel I could be a lot faster if I, read, if I wrote this thing. This is taking quite a bit. Oh. Time to drink some coffee from a small mug. I'm literally drinking coffee from the dark side. <laughs> non sponsored by the way. I won't say who made that, but <laughs> I just I just saw that thing and I just fell in love with it. It's a huge cup. You can literally put like two huge cups of coffee in there. Ah, enough caffeine to stay Cheerio. fully awake forever. Okay, so joining that quest, uh, let's see. Captain Redpath, thank you for the quest. There's Victory General Sunstrack. Yeah, yeah. Um, there should be a Griffin Master somewhere here. Ah, okay. Urk Gagbads. Strength. What are you looking for? Can we do with this guy? Oh, he's afraid of forces. All right. So we got the flight location. But there is one more quest and stuff. Okay, well, that is a pretty shiny beacon, like Argent Crusade. Props for, props for shininess. That was extremely, extremely shiny. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, that's too much light. Can I help you, Mr. High Beacon? See you later. Greetings. For the alliance. And we found a traveling companion. Perfect. So uh, can we just go down here? That's okay. A little bit of falling damage. Gonna rag up easily. What do you need to do? I need to find the little Pamela. We also need to turn in this quest somewhere. Yep. Our enemies will fall. Yes, yes, yes. And now we go back here and we we collect the head of an outcast. Isn't that isn't that a little bit evil? Like you cast the poor guy out, and then you send some mercenary after him to cut off his head. I find that decidedly evil. Oh, don't get me wrong, I like evil things. Oh, black bad. Oh, okay. We just blasted it with holy power. By fire be purged. Ah, oh, I love Ragnaros. Okay, well. Okay, are these, are these like undead zombie whatever? Yeah, yeah, okay. These are undead zombie trolls, so... Um, I stand corrected. Yeah, now I want to kill the guy. There's two things that don't mix well together. Necromancers and dead bodies. I think, I'm, I'm just guessing he's a necromancer. 
whatever he is, we will uh, make sure that that necromancer gets his just reward. And by that I mean getting paddled, of course. And my sword of justice. Oh, okay. Never mind. It is actually a huge troll. Like he's literally a troll. I, are you trolling with all those stuns? Heal up again. Oh, okay. Ah, this guy is actually the real deal. Stop stunning me, please. There we go. Take off his head. Which is quite huge. I have no idea how he fits that into his pocket. But okay. We have his head, and now we can go back to killing plague bats and. Uh, yeah. Going towards little Pamela. Who I suspect is probably not going to be very little. Yeah, always having to reach around this microphone boom right here is a little bit awkward. I'll try to think of a better setup for this. By the way, if you missed yesterday, the stream was pretty cool. In MechWarrior Online, we had over 30 people turn in. Uh, not turn in, tune in. The turn in means to go to sleep. That they didn't do. That was that was a lot of fun yesterday. I'm uh, looking to repeat that very soon. Okay, so that is little Pamela, and she is dead. Okay. Um, hello. Yeah, we completed the quest. What else? To find her doll and find a blade. Okay. So this is the doll. Should be somewhere around here. Probably inside the house. Uh, okay, we found the doll's head. Um, it's just a little bit creepy. Um, left side of the doll. Um, it's another doll's head. <laughs> um, hmm. I like the art style here, it reminds me a little bit of the old um, Super Nintendo games. They would also use like, this kind of dark brown tones. Um, hello. Where's the other part of that doll? Need the right side of the doll. Maybe in here? Ah, this looks like it. Ta-da! And now we have a doll. And we also still need to get the hunting blade. Oh, cool. It is spirit animals. Whatever reason. Um the lone hunter. That's a wolf. A sword. Stuck right in his face. Okay. Now I've seen it all. Come on, give me 30% so I can do this. Come on, come on. Okay, let's try and see if we can... Can, can we be fancy? Just blocked my hamstring, okay. Charge! And execute. Okay. That was almost fancy. Almost. Not quite. Um... That's the personal spotlight. Put a light in all this darkness. And maybe switch the mount to something else. What what could we what could we use for a mount? Hmm. Oh I know. Um nope. Wrong button. Where's the oh here we go. Let's go core hound. Aha! The Infernal Dogs of Doom! It's a little hard to see the quest givers now, but that's okay. I'm riding a freaking core hound. And return to the guy. Okay, that was easy. Now, can we make use of these items? That belt? Absolutely. Those gloves? Mm, they have dodge instead of haste, so no. How, how do you... 
Okay, he just dismounts me. Alright. We'll deal with him. Okay, he dealt himself with himself. Perfect. I like to call him Fluffy. <laughs> oh, right, we still have to kill the plague bats. Because there were none at the, areas, at the areas we went. So, the terrifying screech of those plague bats, I think. Oh, hang on, it's a gargoyle I don't want. Okay, well, now I've got him. Should be a fear. Yep. But as I said, boom, we can break that with Berserker Rage. Which is a funny coincidence that we actually got these two skills right next to each other. Or, or right when we actually needed it. I find that funny. There's a chapel with that big light, that's where we got one of the quests up there. Oh, come on. Yeah. I actually put it on a long cooldown. As you can see, it has a 1 minute cooldown now. That's still okay for most users. And if I'm not lazy, I just interrupt the fear and nothing happens. There's other things you could do as well. Let's see if I can pull it off. Just wanna see if I can pull it off. Like jumping away out of range. And you can't get feared because it's melee range only. Or... Let's see, where is Alt J? Do I already have that skill? I think I have it already. No, I don't. Level 70 is intimidating shout. Okay. Never mind, I said nothing. Like you could literally counter fear the enemy fear. <laughs> like whoever yells at the other guy first wins. By the way, guys, um, if you're new to the game or leveling a character, it's it's really good practice to just get used to um, interrupt any casts that you see, because that way later on, when you're actually in, in instances and in raids, and it really counts, you'll do it automatically. You don't even think, because that's a thing that a lot of people, even even people that do really good DPS and have a really good understanding of the characters don't have ingrained in them and uh, it's fine to let, let do the tank or let, let, let tank handle it um, whenever let's say there's only one caster or whatnot but in bigger packs there's gonna be a multitude of casters and uh, really helpful you press that interrupt button so train early so you won't have to train later <laughs> what's that spectral corpses I don't like those. You also do a little bit less damage to ghosts. But that might just be... That might just be... Um, me being crazy. Or it might have been another game. It might have been Dark Age of Camelot, but that happened. Where it would do less physical damage to ghosts. So, with that as well, now we can go ahead and tune and... Up our speed and turn in all those quests. Stump, 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 stump. It's funny how the core hound always seems slower, but we're riding at the same speed. It's just that because the animals are bigger, it seems slower. <laughs> Alrighty. Speak, friend. Yep. That. May your blades never here, die. he is dead. Here is his head. You need something. Blade. Oh, more quest. See you to bring it to Chrome. Where the hell is Chromie? Oh, okay. She's gonna be here. First, let's go to the top. Round and round we go. Oh, too much light. Hey there. Be careful. Argent parachutes. Cool. Oh. Too much light. I'm going to go down there. Do you have a parachute now? Yes, I do. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Um, so where's Chromie? There is Chromie. Level 47, Dragonkin. 
old here. Okay, villains, heroes, and marauders of Darusher. Okay. And then we have wow, to talk to Fiona sick. to do the trek continues, okay? Um, so, first heroes. Hmm. Okay. No location. She wants to move to the next tower. Let's do that. And then potentially fly back here, but there's still a quest here that I didn't get. I don't know why. Oh, here. Rotar. For the whole. Okay. Uh, let's go. Yeah, okay. Let's go to the next tower first. What is Argus Journal? Additional 2% XP bonus. Yes, please. That is what I'll take. Aha! Even more experience. That's good. That? Ah, oh, but that is what the mute button is for. Otherwise, you guys would be deaf now. Why is the dwarf now up there with the crates? <laughs> with the crates and with the trunks. Dwarven luggage. Alright. So this is the quest area where we get the first little piece, but also this is probably gonna move, okay. But Darushire should be somewhere... If I'm not 100% mistaken, it should be somewhere around here. That, that should be Darshire, actually. And there is <laughs> skulls warning us not to go there. Okay, that, that's a wise move. That's, that's a good move. Let's, let's not go where the skulls are. <laughs> yeah, this is the whole area that um, got destroyed by Arthas and the Death Knights. Ah... Uh. This is what happens when the undead run rampant. That's why you need to take the undead and make them real dead. So Sylvanas, I'm coming for you. I, c <laughs> I wonder if there's any way that Sylvanas will survive this add-on. Like, everybody hates her. The Horde players hate her, the Alliance players hate her. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see if she survives. Okay. What do you offer? It continues, okay, okay, yeah, let's hope chapel, oh yeah, that's over there. Let's get the quest from Wex Tool over here. Get on with it. A test of strength, oh, okay. We're doing a test of strength now. Oh, I thought that was a test, we're all dead. You'll be needing something. Ta -da! Level 48. That's what I'm talking about. Um, let's get those quests. Oh yeah, Argent Dawn dudes. Hey. Hey. Very good. And yeah, we got one. And then there's another quest. So up we go. Again, round and round. Light. light. Too much light. For the okay. Um, how can I... Oh, yeah. So. Now we got the villains as well. So we can go back... Here. Hmm. Hmm. Now I'm slightly puzzled. How are you? It's okay. We'll find it out. We'll we'll, we'll find out where we need to go. For now, we need to go to um this pond. Yeah.
Okie dokie. So. Let us. I mean, we still need to get the shield. I mean, the red puff dude is here, so let's just talk to him. Greetings. Okay, got that. Have a good one. Now we need to go back here. Get, get the Libram. And once we have that, we can go to the uh, Scenarian Tenacity Quest. In the Fungal Valley. Hmm. Ah, plague throwers. Catapults. Even the sky is like, I don't know, rotten. <laughs> it's orange and brown and orange and lots of blight hounds around. Ha! I see it. Almost there. Woof. Couldn't they make them a little bit smaller? Here, doggy doggy. Done. No more dogs. Get the shield. Done. Um, Devil's Libram. Okay, so maybe that thing is up here. Oh yeah. Of course, with more plague hounds. Okay, there it is. It's inside the hearth. <laughs> It's a pretty evil place to hide something like that. I hate that when they die at the same time. That does not enable me to... Whoa! Where are these guys coming from? Doesn't enable me to use my... Victory Rush! That was the word I was looking for. Okay. I hope that's enough Blighthounds now. Okay. Yeah, that was enough blood hounds. Hang on. Here we go. Sun grass. Now we don't need that. What we do need is experience. We still have 118% rest XP. So if things hold on like this. We'll be able to get to level 53-54. Goddess, bless you. Goddess, light my path. Goddess, okay, you. we need to kill dark cultists and we Go need to into. use the seeds in the center of whatever area we're going to. Dum -de -dum. I need to get skulls from these guys, okay. One skull, that is. Oh, I 100% demolished this guy. How many skulls do I need? Oh, I remember that zone. <laughs> That's a pretty cool zone. I think I got max level in one of these areas for a different character of mine. The thing I remember about it is tons of undead. Uh, speaking of the devil, in this case undead. There we go. So in this, we need to do something in the center, right? Need to plant the zigs, uh, stuff in the ziggurats. We need to destroy plague disseminators, which are which things exactly? Ah, okay, he has a control room, so this guy. This guy needs to go. Or not? Can we do anything with this? Nope. That's okay. Got we've got more mages that we can kill. No worries. But plant the seed in the, the ziggurat first. 
the hell is that? Can we plant the seed right here? No, not yet. Maybe now? Nope. Alright, alright. I understand. We need to go in there. Stand right here, right? No? This one? Yes. We're fighting the undead with flower power. That's gonna work. Well, that's that's a plague disseminator. All right. Okay. See, the more you know. Sometimes it's good to just look up. See the sky. Okay. Now we've got a control rune. Now we can take down one of these. I think. Yeah. Pew. Okay. Boom. That was a nice effect. Dum -de -dum. Two more runes, which means we can take on two more of these. Luckily there's one coming right for us. It's coming right for us! Zzz. Zappy Mech zaps a lot. Fire off phasers! There we go. Leave me, leave me alone please, guys. I don't need your kind anymore. They just kicked me in the face, okay. Okay. This means war. How rude. Plant the next seed. There we go. One more to go. It's funny how the um, experience bar doesn't really doesn't feel like it's moving much when you're killing monsters. But then you turn in the quest, it goes like boom, boom, boom. <laughs> ah, I just love that. Shoot up the speed. Can we run around the corner? Nope. No charging around corners today. We shall not be cutting and charging corners. Why are these guys kicking? It's not very mage-like. Okay. Anything else to do here? Nope. We're done. Still market with fitted skulls. Quest items. Hmm. Oh. Because it tests its resonance, but can I do it here as well? Okay. Well. Let's see. One. Two, nope, three, four, I need more skulls, I need more skulls for the skull throne, it's finally happened, okay, um, let's turn these two quests, boom, boom, that was fast, let's see, this thing useful, crit out and haste in, oh, one strength, yeah, why not, Oh, I can't swap it right now because I am being attacked by a gargoyle. 
Ein garstiger Gargoyle. Okay, maybe we can get one more skull from him. And that could solve all our problems. So, Mr. Scourge Champion, will you be the hero to solve our problems? He is. Ta da! Ta da! I need minions for these quests. How awesome would it be if you had like a band of like 100 yellow banana style minions? You just can send them in on any quest. And they just go there and do everything for you. Just You just collect the loot. That would be amazing. Also, I need to kill these guys. Otherwise they're just gonna, gonna follow me home and we don't need that. Alrighty. So, we are looting the Skull of Horgus. Which ends all this fighting. Perfect. And the last item, the Shattered Sword of Marduk. Isn't Marduk a heavy metal band? Death metal band or something? Hmm. Tons of aggro mobs in this area. There we go. Take the sword. Thank you. Everyone is saved and we can go back to the mountain top. Turn in more quests. There's three now that are ready to turn in. The Marauders, Villains and Heroes of Darrowshire. Hmm. Okay. So, number one, Chromie. Hmm, haven't we done this before? Maybe. One, two, three. Uh, okay. Do a lot more. I do a lot more tasks for me. Of course, Chromie. Of course, Chromie. For you always. Because Kuromi, Kuromi is not a not a gnome. She's a dragonkin. She's, a, she's actually a bronze dragon of time. So um, yeah, lots of time traveling shenanigans happening with Kuromi. Now let's just place that um, satchel or whatever. Bonk. No, hello. There's nothing happening. Oh, there's one. We need to defend Dyrshire. Okay. Let's uh, do that then and kill those two and a half marauding corpses. Oh, three and a half. Okay. Okay, that was a lot of murdering. That looks like a paladin. Who is a ghost? Who we now have to protect for some reason. That's okay. We'll just do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, ghosts. Where are the ghost bastards when you need them? Hang on. That's the evil dude. Let's kill him. Oh, 
Oh, that should have been all of them, hopefully. No. Accept Red Puff's forgiveness. Do I have to go back there or do something? No. Okay, he's dying now. Alright. So many marauding corpses around here. This is a long ass quest. Careful that they don't kill Captain Redpuff. Hmm, are we going over here now? Are we fighting eternally now? Or what's going on here? Oh, Darusha betrayers. Okay, this guy's a new. Okay, he gets converted by a death knight. That explains a lot of things. Okay, done. Got it. We have forgiven him, now maybe we can unite him with his little baby girl and everything shall be fine. At least that's the theory. Yep. Red Path Bracers. In the chest, which is where exactly? Hello? Am I blind? Hidden treasure. Out back behind the house. Okay, well. There. Ta da! Those should be good bracers. Oh, yeah, that's a good increase. And if you think I just I just read all the stats, no, I didn't. I just looked at this thing, uh, at the bracer. I saw that it has, um, relative to the previous item, it has only increases, no decreases, and then I equip it. That's that simple. You don't have to think too much on that. Okay, so... Next up, Black Puffers, Infectus Inchers, and Infectus Scuttlers, and we need to get, uh, we need to make a cultist naked. <clears throat> that will be the only cult I ever join. <laughs> okay, so, um, this, oh, do we have to go into the water for this? Kinda looks like it. Yep, looks very much like it. Well, here we go. Into the dark abyss we dive. Whoa, that is really a dark abyss. Come on, zoom in. Okay. We don't need these. 
Um, we don't need any of these. Plague puffers. I don't see any plague puffers. Yes, this is target, but where? Huh? Doesn't make sense. Oh, these down here, okay. Maybe we do have to kill those fish. Let's find out, shall we? Nope. Okay, we just have to collect them. Alright. Oh dear. This is literally a go swim here and right click everything quest. Why? This is it. Why? Literally uh, swim around and right click everything quest. If you've ever played Counter Strike or whatnot, you have a advantage in this quest. <laughs> you should be able to click them faster. Okay, we need um yeah. Go away fish. Can't you can't can't you see I'm trying to collect stuff here? I mean I realize you don't wanna share your grubs with me and whatnot, but still. I got a big sword. Fish. Okay, we need a few more of these and one more puffer. Okay, and now we just need a few of these nails. And what are the scuttlers? Scuttlers are the scuttlers are the um, crab-like animals. So these guys. Nope. Nope. This guy. Can you please stop that? I'm on the verge of doing a fish genocide down here. You guys don't stop that. There we go, that's the scuttler coming. Yep. And snails. Snail. Okay. Three more scuttlers. Let's see three scuttlers. And then we're done here. And you fish can live in peace forever. There we go. Goodbye, fish. I am ascending to the heavens. Which means... I'm just literally... Not diving here anymore. And you guys can be left alone. Okay. Living rot. Need seven pieces of living rot. We can do that. Let's go. American pride. Yes. Yes. Ear the wrath of Namerigan. <laughs> the revenge of the gnomes. Okay, so here we can get the all the other stuff that we need. Uh, and so of course, since he's from a uh, different faction, can't really get the um, items if we hit those. Hmm. Look at this air trains. Everything's coming to join me. Come on. Okay, okay, okay. Right back into it. A little bit more living rot. And I still need some cultist garbs. I want your clothes, your jacket, and your motorcycle. Unfortunately, I don't remember the exact words that Arnold used. Or maybe that someone will have some clothes for me. Yep, yep, we had lots of stuff, okay. Dark Garb is completed. And we can maybe... Do we have enough living rot? Nope. 
Need two more living rot. Okay. Get that. Probably not from the summoner though. Yeah, keep your zombies to yourself, buddy. Nobody wants them. Got a dark rune. Haha. Store mana at the cost of life. Yeah, that doesn't doesn't pertain to us. Here, Mr. Water. Okay. Oh, of course, sure, sure. Skeleton. Join in, why not? You can also drop living rot. We're all good. Okay, now it's a little bit much. What is that train here? I have not ordered all these mobs. Can you please take him back, please? Otherwise I will have to refund them on my own. And you will not like that if I refund them. With my sword. There we go. Okay, that's enough. We can use that to make a coagulated rot. Done. Romy likes that as well. And now we need to get living plague agents. Okay. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Have we got this mount for doing Molten Core during the 10 year anniversary? But I might be wrong. And we're level 49. Look at that. Okay, so, oh yeah, we need to get these guys now. Okay. Gather sample from the bodies. Okay. Prepare the body. That's what the, what the guy says in the King's Rest. Like the elemental. Doesn't work. Okay, so maybe it's these blighted surges. Hmm. Or was I? All right. Um. What's the name? Don't remember his first name, but his title is the Embalmer. Why is this invalid target? Okay, now I'm a little bit. No. So use the f yeah I'm doing exactly what I'm supposed to do am I stupid hey does it say invalid target um okay apparently I'm stupid I don't know why I don't know how but I am so um try and see if we can find some other elementals or anything Literally anything. And there's more blighted surges down here. It should work. It says gather from the corpse. Oh no, okay. Haha. <laughs> okay. You have to use it first. And you gather it not from the corpse, you gather it from the living thing. Okay, never mind. It doesn't say gathered from the corpses. Um I just thought it said gathered from the corpses. TTB fails at reading 2.0. But all is well. Now that we know how to do it. The rest is going to be easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. No, 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 click, 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 please, okay. <laughs> almost, I almost, almost forgot all the killing I was doing. I can literally feel you guys going like, no, what are you doing? One more. Actually, no, two more.
Ooh. Okay. That's going faster than expected. I'm happy about that. The good thing is, if we kill about 15 mobs, that is one full quest done as well. In terms of XP. Okay, need to use all these guys now to do something. First we go upstairs, and now we go here. To disturb the cauldron, for whatever reason. I like gnomes. They go well with fire and give you better loot. Okay, let's use the disguise. Boom. Okay, and now how do we... Okay, well we just right click on it. Already. Um... Throw an ultra buff. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> I think I put it a little bit too much. <laughs> I nuked the whole place. <laughs> okay. Hey, if you give me that option, you know what's gonna happen, right? <laughs> okay. Back to Light Shield Tower. Could put in one drop, one flask, or you could just dump the whole crate. And I mean, if, hey, if one drop is good, then one must be better, right? <laughs> Makes you surprised it didn't kill me. Oh, come on, why do you daze me? Leave me alone. Okay, they all wanna they all wanna party with me. Okay. I will just we'll just hamstring these guys so they can't chase us as well. Come on, I said hamstring him. Yes. Bye bye guys. <laughs> ah yes. What's on your mind? I should turn around any second now. There we go. They've realized that it is futile to chase me. Um, you know? Nice you. Yo, uh, choose my reward. Light shield. Actually, not a bad looking shield. Be seeing you. Now we still need to go upstairs. Do we? Yep. And these towers. Quite a bit of walking to do. Oops. Um, talk to well him. Met. Here you go, here's your stuff. Thank you for the helmet, and we get Infectious Puffer Sashimi. Get water breathing for 20 seconds. So Perfect. Honored, okay, so we're done here, now we can go to Light's Hope Chapel. Um, I think we need to use the caravan for that. Whoops. Hello, light. Too much light in my eyes. There is a death knight. Nope. Armbands. It's just it's just buffs. So is she, is she just going to stay here? Okay, so we're not moving with the caravan anymore. Okay. Then we shall just fly to Light's Hope Chapel. Much easier, much faster. Oh, we're closing in. Closing in on 50. Very nice. Did we get any new skills? No, not yet. We get something on 50? Yes, we get the Colossus Smash. Oh, yeah. This is going to be amazing to deal with groups of enemies. Increase the damage we deal to them by 30% for 10 seconds. And it's a huge upfront uh, damage spike. That's really nice. A lot of time here in Classic. Well, not here, but the chapel looked a little bit different back then, I think. Okay, so what do we have to do here? Hello, Mr. Gold Braids. Speak with Lord whatever. Um, Nuki the Roo. Um, let's go in there. Talk to Lord Bartholomew the Reward. 
and Lord Maxwell Tyrosis. Okay. Two more quests down here to accept. One from the Earthen Ring, okay, and one from. I seen you around here before. No, we don't want to go to the Badlands. Not right now. Ah, oh, I've been expecting you. Mm-hmm. Be careful. I have been expecting you to gather grab meat. Yeah, it's it's family time. I don't know why he's laughing. So we need to go in here and we need to do the trial of the crypt. Hmm. Hello, is anyone in here in the script? I'm here to do a trial. Hello, do I have to? Okay, read the scroll. Ta da! How about now we fight? Rise and meet in combat. Okay, Kaboom. He's dead. Not very durable, these guys. So what now? Oh, one more. All done. You satisfied now, Mr. Blue Eyes? With the big sword? Mine's bigger. Hmm. I was an Argent Crusader Orc. <laughs> oh dear. I just wanna mow down this guy, it should be possible, right? Nope. More ghosts. Mm-hmm. Time for a gnome dance. Oh yeah, shake it, baby. Jump, jump, down, down. Okay, that aggroed him. Shouldn't have started dancing. That's okay. He doesn't do any damage. We'll make short work of him. Done. Well done, heroes. You have passed the test. You have slain me. Mm-hmm. Back into the light. It's actually funny how the whole zone looks different here. A little bit of green and whatnot. Even inside the eastern plague lands, but just inside these walls. <laughs> it's also decorated for Brewfest. <laughs> Join the Argent Crusade. Like, like up here. Join the Arishan Crusade. Fight the enemies of the living and drink beer. Need help? Okay. Be careful. I will join you, Crusade. All right. Oh, let's see what, what the what does this guy want. Be careful. Touched blades. Okay. Oh, more quests. One from this guy. King's honor, friend. King's honor. To kill the rattle gore and for the alliance. Annals of the Silver Hand from Stratholm. Uh, let me guess. Okay, yeah, that's dungeon quest. Um, yeah, we won't do that. Okay, you can keep your quest. Um, yeah, this would go towards um, a high level area back in the classic where you would farm for cash, but we'll go there later. Let's go to those blades first. Or should we get the. Nah, let's go get the, the warm meat first. Um, go kill some grubs. Aren't there daily quests here in classic? I seem to remember. But not quite. Or re re repeatable reputation quests or something. There was something here. I remember the zone too well. 
Or maybe it was because that's the path towards that grinding area. I'm really looking forward to the classic service. Can't wait until they finally go live. Ay ay ay. Rubs. more meat. Three more and we shall be done with these disgusting things. Looked like a fat sandworm. <laughs> Big sandworm of dune. A spice controls the galaxy. Spice will flow. Okay, there we go. Got that. Ah, oh, let's just go down here. While oh, we're at it. Since we're in the area. By the way, dune, um... Lots of good movies and miniseries, also amazingly good books. Finally read the last two volumes. Um, I read Dune Saga like 20 years ago, uh, up until book 7 or so, and then uh, of course it stopped because there were no more books, because Frank Herbert died, but his uh, son finished it with the help of another author. And uh, oh, it was an amazing, amazing ending. Tears Hand, Scarlet Crusaders, oh yes, I remember this area. I you farm this whole place just killing these guys and they weren't level 48 right now like these guys they were level 61 elites or 62 I believe suffice to say you had to have good gear to be able to farm these guys at all but it was so worth it in terms of cash 100% worth it boom Scarlet Crusade. All must be purged by fire. here get this guy good more we're done okay do we have to go inside the chapel no behind the chapel little Crusaders flare, okay. You take the barracks and to take the abbey. Oh, I like that. Lots of lots of quests to do in this area. Just keeps on building the experience uh, halfway through already. Um Okay, so report to him. What can I do for you? Whoa! Okay. Okay, yeah yeah, yeah yeah. Get everything. Murder everything. See you later. Just get, just, just get in there and do, do deeds, do dirty, dirty deeds. Okay. Um, first of it would be looting. 
Okay. Anything else in here? Nope. We have to kill these guys, maybe. More stuff we can loot, so... Since you guys are defending that loot, that means... We need to go, unfortunately. I'm sorry. A little bit. No more holy lights for you. Okay. Oh, we need to find the Shroud of Ufer as well, okay. Gavin Rad Sigil. This is what I'm after. Can't you let me loot in peace? Freaking paladins. Here, heal this. Best XP at 74%. Wow, that went down fast. Okay, now we just need to sigil and we're good. It. Now we need to go upstairs. Huntsman Leopold, Mateo is the Roughcaster, and Scarlet Commander Magarin. Oh, it's an Archmage. He's casting Fireball. And then he got hit in the face. So we find our first target out here. Okay, well, there's a commander. He wasn't hard to find. You don't exercise me, come on. There's nothing to exercise, I'm a gnome. Not the arch evil. I will kill you, or I will die trying. Or oh. at least he left himself some choice. Oh, some room for error. Oh, you died trying. <laughs> okay, so... We need to go upstairs now again. Outside, potentially. Get these last two guys. No, one is probably below and one is on the roof. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I realize what you're doing there. So there is Huntsman Leopold. Standing there. Why is he standing in a trap? Vipers, okay. Whirlwind! No more vipers. Done. And now, last but not least. Uh, can we just pile down here, maybe? Perfect. There should be a way downstairs, somewhere. Oh, here we go. Perfect, and there's the last guy I need. Suffering victims. Wow. Not so friendly, that Scarlet Crusader. Let's put them out of the misery. There we go, no more suffering. Also, they were undead anyway, so it's okay. <laughs> okay. That's three quests done. Very quickly. And that could give us a good amount of XP. I like this quest up quite a bit. You need something? Here you go. So we're at 69%. Let's see how far we get. Oh, 91%. For the Alliance. Just checking the wrong XP bar, but that's okay. Need help? Safe travels. Now we go inside here into that cathedral and do a similar thing. Can I help you? I think. Ah, just two. Have a good one.
I remember this zone because I got lost here once. Trying to find something and just couldn't find it. Hopefully it doesn't happen now again. <laughs> that would be embarrassing. Okay, this part I also remember. 10,000 mobs adding. But what do we have to do here, anyways? Rohan the Assassin's Lane, okay. Open the portal wings, okay. So open two portals and kill one guy. It should not be that difficult, right? There's where the way up is, okay. Um, but here we can open a portal, I think. Yep. Portal is open. Does it help us at all if we go upstairs? No, it doesn't. Except it gets us into combat, but that's okay. Uh, let's go this way. Still behind me, no. Well, somewhat he still is, but that's okay. I think I need to go downstairs here. This is not. This is not fruitful. I'm not healing anybody, good sir. We need to go this way. To open up the library portal. library portal, then it needs to be upstairs. That's the only explanation I have. Lucky us, there are some stairs around here. And this looks promising, perfect. Ta-da! Okay, I think the rogue that we need to kill is upstairs then. Oh, I was actually going the right way, but I uh, want to make sure that we don't get a secondary follow-up quest that else leads us up here. Oh no, the American Bride is out. Okay, let's go. Orb of Deception. Now I am an orc. A pissed orc, apparently. I'm pissed about something. Maybe I was being green all the time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hello? Oh, look at that. It's a rogue. Boom. Level 50, achievement earned, and we get... Colossus Smash. Onto the W key. Okay, perfect. W stands for win. Ah, the joy. Joy. We have Colossus Smash. I'm happy now. I can die a happy warrior now. Ah, where's the quest to turn in? Here we go. Greetings. And we could get some legs, uh, or a trinket. But both of them are not really good, so we don't... doesn't really matter, so... Take anything. And we need to go to Cure's yeah. Hand. Uh, let's go there. It's exactly here. Same guy. What can I do for you? Slay Crusader Lord Valdemar. Be careful. I don't know about you guys, but I would have chosen a different name if I were a Crusader Lord, not Valdemar. Valdi! Sounds like a dog. And I shall slay him like the dog he is. Oh, 
Actually, those healing potions might be a little bit more potent than the ones I have right now. Yep, so let's put them in our bar. Do we have something we can drink? Well, we can drink elixir of giant growth. And when do we can... When can, when can we can you... Okay, we can start using the flasks now. That's good to know. But yeah, we're just going in there and killing these guys. Yeah, those Praetorians were really strong back then. Let's hope they're not still really strong. Nope, they're not. That should be the only quest here, yep. That should be the last quest here. Alrighty. Yeah, I knew they were going to add, so that's why I didn't rush in. Let's kill this guy as well. Boy, he does something stupid. Hmm. Can we just pull him like this? Next to the face. Okay, very first Warbreaker, Colossus Smash. Boom! Now, I wasn't very effectful. Probably because it didn't crit. Looks a little bit different when it crits. Hmm. I was a little bit anticlimactic. Stop stunning me. Hang on a second, I'm a human, right? So why, why couldn't I? Should be able to break out of stuns as a human, right? Every man for himself. Oh, because I didn't select, because I didn't press shift one. Okay, never mind. I already had it in my bar. Just not used to using it anymore. Hey Kamajin, how's it going? I was so absorbed in killing these crusaders, I didn't even read that. <laughs> Sorry that you had to uh, uh, thanks thanks for the bits and thanks for Getting me out of the super. I have a hot steed. Yeah, it's a quite a hot thingy. Um, not running with your level up, dude, tonight? What do you mean, not running my level up, dude? Being green stopped hard from getting laid. Um, have you have you watched... Uh, which one was it? Which one of the Avengers movies? Um... I think it was Age of Ultron, where Tony Stark says, You guys better not be playing hide the zucchini. <laughs> oh, I love that movie. That was beautiful. Really looking forward to the next Avengers movie, but I think it's it's uh, another year or so until it comes out. Oh, that is, that is the character I'm, I'm playing. It's, it's just was just a little bit transmogrified. The same dude, see? That's a different mount. Stomp, stomp, stomp. <laughs> he thought he'd be bigger. <laughs> no, no. He's the right size. If I gnomify myself, I'm even smaller. So let's see. Um, here you go, Mr. Torrent Shaman. Um, have your grub meat and uh, dig in. Actually, that trinket wouldn't be bad. Do I have quicker strike? Hmm. Let's keep the haste for now. And then we need to go in there and turn that quest in. That should be it for Argent Crusade. What? This area. Bartholomew's Belch, which is a really good belt, coincidentally. Okay. Now we can go to the right side and kill more stuff. That's on the adventurous task board. Burning steps, searing gorge, and thousand needles. Okay. <laughs> yeah. The next time I level a character, I'm gonna level it in Kal Kalimdor, because I feel like we've done a lot of leveling here in, the, in this area already. Can get a little bit older sometimes. 
pestilence scar and diseased flares. Which we need to kill. Okay, that's good to know. And then we also need to get some saplings from in here. So, Stephen Broman. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, where are these guys coming from? Ah, oh, these two are my minions. Perfect. Perfect. I'm found at a point where I have minions. <laughs> 1200 execute. That's the power of Warbreaker. Very nice. Okay, so we got that. And now we need to go back here. Bring some more blades and kill cultists and everything. Like literally go in there and murder everything that, that you see that walks or casks or casts or shambles or otherwise does anything. You're the minion? Unfortunately I can't name them, otherwise I would name one after you. Here. Uh, in your honor I will be throwing the golden banana. Punk. This will be the ultimate minion catnip. It's, it's a freaking golden banana. Banana. It doesn't do anything, you just throw it and it just sits there. What the hell is that? Garginox. Okay, this guy is pretty big. 26k HP. I don't want to mess with him, I think. He looks a little bit pissed. Like, not really friendly. If it was a true Australian banana, it would be boomeranging back. <laughs> a boomerang banana? A banana rang? That would be the next big thing. Um, skull mages? Yeah, cultists. We need cultists. All these guys are cultists. Perfect. Come to me, cultists. I have a job for you. Of course, that job is dying. Boom. Okay, burying blades, slaying minions, murdering the undead. I mean, I would be pissed as well as an undead if I looked like that. Brains. Nope. Oh, wall break itself, crit to 870. That's nice. 1200 execute again. <laughs> what the hell are you talking about, dude? We will persevere. You got my attention. Great to meet you. You got my attention. What can I do for you? Dwarves. And blood elves. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Maybe, maybe the vegans do. Grains. <laughs> Need to be mindful of where that big hulking colossus goes. I don't want him sneaking up on me. That would be terrifying. These guys are actually quite tacky. Okay, so we need to kill four more of these guys and no more cultists. So 
These guys. It's a banshee. Look at that face. Whoa. Okay, enough benching around. No, you don't fear me. You just get executed. Can I? Why do I keep missing her? All right, she gave me. She gave me the banshee's touch. Caused you to miss all hits, and if you get that, back in the good old days, <laughs> to try, for example, tanking those mobs, and you can't hit a thing, and your taunt misses, and all your attacks miss, and your healers and the DPS get chopped up and eaten by all these undead. Uh, fun times. Okay, I need to bury more blades. Um, for that, I need to find more corpses. Oh, here's one more. Need to, need to make sure I keep burying those blades. One. Nah. Uh, okay, we have to fight this. It also helps to actually aim at the target you want to war break. Hmm. I guess we're finding it out on the hard way again. Let's just go back the way we came. Hopefully there is more skeletons there that we can still bury. Yeah, there's one more. Ready to go. We're walking right into the Colossus. <laughs> Two to go. Please don't move. There's the second to last one. So where's the last one? Let's just go through here. See if we can find one more here. Yep, we can actually. Yep, that's it. We're done. Come on. Clicky clicky. And we're out of here. So long undead. Peace out. Don't for write don't forget to write me a postcard. Back to the Argent Crusade it is. Oh my rest of the XP has really shrunken down. 40% left only. <laughs> what did I predict? Level 54? Uh, I don't think so. I think the more realistic prediction would have been uh, 51 or 52. It's good to know that rest XP only lasts for about 4 to 5 levels now. Gives us a good benchmark. So we know what to expect. You got my attention. Here you go. Watch your back. I always watch my back. Like literally 24-7 when playing World of Warcraft, I'm always watching my back. That's the reason why a lot of people actually play female characters, because they don't like staring at a man's ass. What can I do? <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. Be careful. What can I do for you? Okay, we did that as well. Now the Earthen Ring has another quest for us. That is nice of them. And actually, I didn't even see that. There's another quest inside. Let's see. Yes, yeah, for us. Mr. Terrena Sunstrike. Baladash Malanore. Baladash Malanore. That's all I always say. The reckoning is at hand. The reckoning is at hand. Avast, ye. Oh, sorry. Wrong. Wrong thing. I went, I went from Argent Crusader to Pirate. <laughs> Avast ye, the reckoning is at hand. Prepare to board them and turn them into the undead and release the Scourge. So now we even went to Death Knight. Uh, okay. That's a big cup of coffee. Uh, it was tied like a pirate day last week. It actually was an uh, in-game event as well. We could dress up like a pirate. Get some in-game in loot. Speak your peace. Speak your peace, man. There be work. What do you offer? 
Yep. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Cheers, mate. The Legion's end draws near. Okay. I don't understand why he talks about the Legion because the Legion only came in uh, World of Warcraft Legion, which was the last add-on, and this is literally like ten years earlier. But okay, okay. Um, I was just thinking—is that a lamp or a mug? It's a mug with something burning in it. A candle. Okay. I want one of these. Anaria Shola. Actually. Salami Asharanore, okay. Actually, that is the true Latanan mass. Let me, let me make a screenshot of that. Definitely a screenshot of that. Okay, now, no more quests here. So, next we need to go up here, kill the Underlord, and uh, Borlgor, get some eyes and the body of the Warlord. I'm gonna go on a quick bio break, and when I'm back, then we'll go ahead and do all that. See you in about three minutes. Be right back. And we are back. Alrighty. So, with the magic of editing, you guys have not witnessed that pause if you're watching this on YouTube. Now, we're gonna go ahead and uh, move towards Ixlar the Underlord and his minions. Okay, well. The problem with being a minion is that. Well, you die first. Whoa, okay, uh... That's a lot of minions. Okay. But they... <laughs> they don't have any health to speak of. Uh, can you please stop chain stunning me? That is a little bit... Unfair. Okay, okay, here, take this. And the... They disarmed me. And stunned me, okay. Okay. Disarm, stun, disarm, stun. That's a little bit too much crowd control. What is this? What am I? Okay. What's going on? <laughs> am I guys adding these guys or what's going on here? I have no idea. I'll just, I'll just start hitting stuff. Whoa. Okay. This was not a good idea. Come on, come on, Warbreaker. I need that. Stun! Disarmed! Uh, need to kill the guard. Take the healing potion. Hopefully kill the guard. Get a victory rush. Wow. I hate it when people just run through a zone and they just bring a whole train of shit to you. That was close. That was close. Way closer than it needed to be. Stun. Followed by disarm. <laughs> okay, whoever made these mobs up was it, uh... This should not have gone through QC. It's way too much crowd control. Really interrupts the game flow. It's okay to have something like that in a dungeon and whatnot, but not uh, in a normal fresh, uh, trash mob. Come on. Hey, Mr. Underlord, you're gonna go down now. Lightning Swarm. Okay. Alright. I get you. I like to be annoying, but it's okay. I like to be annoying too. Say it! Say it! Say it! You're annoying! <laughs> okay. So, uh, hello? Can I see something, please? I'm in combat with something. Oh, here. What do we need to kill here? Borogor. Um, isn't that like a big ass grub or something? Should be a big ass grub somewhere from here. Try and find it. There it is. 
And you're one ugly mother. Done. He be dead. Hmm. On. Why can't I get up here? Okay. Yeah, no. I'd much rather get stuck. Never mind then. When you first don't succeed in this game, at first you don't succeed. You just keep jumping. That is the solution to all problems. Just jump. Okay, what do we need to do here? We need to get, need to get moss flare eyes. And moss flares are trolls, right? Yep, so... Um, let's see how many eyes these guys have. Whoa! Whoa! I got a big unfriendly troll minion. Okay, so he had two eyes. That's good. <laughs> if you're only fighting against one eye trolls all the time, you're not getting many eyes. <laughs> that looked like one of your old roommate's ex-girlfriends? That is creepy. Also, where does the scum scout come from? I like the animation he does when he does um, sweeping strikes, where he raises the sword into the air. Like, by the power of Grey Skull! <laughs> Jump. That would be a good song for a montage, yeah. Actually, back in back in classic and Burning Crusade, we always have used to have uh, jump counters on. An adder that would do nothing else than count how many times you press the spacebar. And at about a hundred thousand or so, you start turning it off because you don't want to know anymore. Oh, we also need to get the body of that warlord over there. Okay. Whoa, 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 what am I doing here? Okay, this is a problem. It's quite a lot of these guys. I didn't have... Victory Rush would be so dead now. Boom. That should be a lot of eyes. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's 15 eyes. Apparently I gouged out one somebody's eyes. <laughs> so yeah, I guess the uh, uh, moral of the story is don't walk over graves because this thing in the graves yeah. might come out and bite you. Hooah. Doesn't to get his buddy. So let's do that. Prepare the body. By that I mean I need to kill him first so he becomes a body. <laughs> when he has a body right now, but now he becomes one. Ah. English is funny sometimes. Here we go. And now. Throw him into the fire. Okay, uh, we can do that. Golly Mashak today! Boom. And now? To the flames. And now? That was it, okay. So now we can get back to uh, the chapel. Or whatever that is. Still in combat, however. It's probably this guy that's keeping me in combat. Waiting to bet gold on it. Let's see if I was right. Nope. Wasn't him. Or maybe it was. Who knows. Right now this guy is keeping me... What the hell are you doing? Oh, 
Of course, you're gonna run to the nearest cannibal and go like, Oh, there's a human there! Let's come and kill him. That's gonna be a nice execute. Boom! 1500. Ah, don't walk over graves. I never learn. Or I've listened too much to uh, Gravedigger. Well, I dance on your grave. Okay. I shall not be singing today. Or ever. Fifty-one. 24% rested bonus left, so 52 should be easily attainable. Ah, spiders. I think I spider. Which literally translated German would be, I think I'm going crazy. Am I doing any Oktoberfest themed streams? Well, I could sit here with a German sized mug of beer. <laughs> maybe, maybe open up a, a little bar below that says like, like like a beer bar, and if it gets if the donations filled up, I have to drink. <laughs> what you seek. I don't have Lidosen. Also, you wouldn't see it because like, where should I put them? Should I put them under my head or what? <laughs> Underlord's oh, mandible. No, we don't need that. What we need is to turn on this quest right here. What's up? Baladash, and then, yeah, yeah, Baladash, Mala, whatever. Um, what do we have here? Good fortune. Good fortune. There you go. Some eyes. Okay. And uh, back there to get his prayer book. Where's the aberrations of, of, of where's the rattle core quest? That's Sholomance. That also makes no sense. We're not going to Sholomance today. All right. You're turning in for the night. Well, have a good night, Imogen. Thanks for dropping by, as always. And I always have fun storming the castle. I was born to storm the castle. Once more into the breach. Okay. Um, also, undead banshees everywhere. Let's see if we can loot fast enough. Loot! Loot faster! No! Didn't loot fast enough. I don't want to get cursed. I did get cursed. Oh, chance to introduce by 30%. Let's see. That was a miss. That's a miss. That's a hit. And that's a hit. Because this skill can never miss. Oh, actually, I don't know. It cannot be dodged, uh, blocked, or parried, but it, can it could potentially miss. And we're done. That was fast. <laughs> you always have to go right through that area. The golems and the spiders. Ay 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 ay. Oh no, no no, not this guy. Uh, of course he dazes me instantly with one hit. <laughs> The one guy that can crowd control you forever also dazes you with one hit. I think the developer was having too much fun here. Okay. Moving on. Here we go. Our enemies will fall. Here's a prayer book, and now we, we ride. Will have justice. Now we ride for North Pass Tower. Relax and enjoy the ride. No more dwarves here? Oh, because the dwarf ran off. Okay. He probably saw some treasure or something. That is quite alright.
North Pass Tower. It's actually quite close to Stratholm. Uh, hello? Oh, that's to Kvalthanas. Okay. Um, where we don't want to go. So if you go to the Ghostlands, from the Ghostlands you could go up here and that is Sunstrider Isle. Yeah, yeah. To where the Blood Elves are from. These guys. Anaria, Shola. Anu Bellore Delana. Victory lies ahead. We will persevere. Anaria, Shola. Every time they do anything like that, I want to slap them. <laughs> okay, tons of quests here. One, two, three, four. Very good. Victory lies ahead. Death to all who oppose us. Okay, well, I can at least get behind that sentiment. We have to get a new buff, I think. Good fortune. Or Hmm. Be well. Get the flight path here. Um. Do we have to actually? No, we are already having it, and it's permanent. Okay, good. No quests up there. Um. Kill the wretched and beat siege engineers. Okay. Let's do that then. Can drink one of those flasks, by the way. Now, onslaught elixir. I don't know how much 16 attack power is. I hope it's a lot. Does it say where my attack power is anywhere? Nope. Oh well. Actually, there's a quest back there. Should probably get that. In case it's like burn those corpses after you kill them. You never know. <laughs> okay, that's why it's called the corpse burner. Okay, I need to get Duskwing, okay. Well since you asked nicely. And Duskwing is a plague bat, okay. Who's flying around up here? Uh, let's try and see if we can get him with the flare. Yeah, he's probably coming right now because I've got an ad with me, that's okay. Even more of those guys, okay. How did that miss? How did I manage to miss him? Those are the questions nobody can answer. How did I miss this big guy? There we go. That was easy. That was decidedly easy. Off to kill some more Texas Rangers. Yeah, uh, sorry, Wretched Rangers. Did I manage to only hit one of them? Oh, this only hits one? Interesting. So it only hits multiple ta targets. 
when you actually have it talented. Okay. More things. The more you know. Let's have a look at that. Okay. <laughs> so, it, and we need to wait until level 75 to get Warbreaker. Okay. But at level 60 we get second wind, at which point leveling is uh, going to be ridiculously easy. Like, you won't believe how easy it's gonna be at that point. Basically, whenever I'm out of combat for like 5 or 6 seconds, I'm gonna regen my health to full within a matter of seconds. And it, is ex it is exactly as powerful as it sounds. Um, hello. I think you forgot your pants, dear lady, sir. I don't know what it is. It's dead now. Okay, so, time to kill Siege Engineers, I think. Let's get a group of them together. The throwing dynamite? What? Why would you throw dynamite? Why would you even have dynamite in the first place? Why doesn't he die? Okay, here we go. These mobs don't really die properly, so that's a problem because it means I can't regen off of them. Okay, I need to discover Gidwin's captor, which might be one of these guys. Maybe. Nope. Okay. First, need to kill this guy. And then I need to eat something in game do I have any food with me anything edible edible here we go just to try and drag a little bit faster because like as I said um, these guys are, they're not dying properly I can't kill them they they die on their own which means I don't get the death blow that means I can't use victory rush um okay you both did beat it out of them though, so perfect. We discovered the capture. That means we can go ahead and turn in the quest. Can we get up there? No. Okay, then we'll go around. If the direct way is not good enough, then we go the indirect way and go around the tower. All around the watchtowers. <laughs> That's what, I should, what they should have called those quests. Because it's literally all around the watchtowers. How may I help you? Always a pleasure. All right, now we need to find Turner Sunstruck, which is uh, okay. He's going to be over there. All right. I have no idea where I'll go after Eastern Plague Lands. Maybe, maybe Blasted Lands. That could be a thing. Because it's also the entry to the Dark Portal. And I think we can switch over to um, Hellfire Peninsula at level 58 or so. Yep. Perfect. That is exactly what we'll do. That is only seven levels away. Well, actually six and a half. Or for the, one, for the ones of you that would like to be very exact, uh, six levels and 31%. Uh, Ah, Plaguewoods. I'm missing Naxxramas. Naxxramas used to be around here. No, it's not anymore. But Classic will be back. Naxxramas will be back.
speak to the Packmeister. That guy. Where is he? Oh, it's also Stratholm. Too many Stratholm quests. Achua. Our enemies will fall. Okay, kill Omasum Blighthoof and Kefris Dakrun. And uh, murder golems, free spirits, and take the skulls. Okay, sure. Sure. Go somewhere, murder everything. That's that's what I can do. That's what I live for. One of my hobbies, actually. Oh yeah, freaking death knight. Okay. I'll show you how we deal with death knights. Ground them and we pound them. Boom. Ooh. Baroness is missive, okay. We also need to get kill this guy and we need to get skulls all over the area, okay. Hmm. Ziggurats. The undead, they love their ziggurats. Luckily this is just a ziggurat and not a spirit tower. If it was a spirit tower, would have a crystal up there and we would all be dead. That was a reference to good old Warcraft 3 for those who are initiated. He's dead. I think he's dead. Or he went for a uh, degree in acting. Cool. He always die with lots of effects. It's beautiful. Um, I need to get overstuffed golems and burn them as well. Um, okay. I need to free the spirits. Which are also all over the area. Okay. A new Bellore de la Na. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah. Here you go. Here you go. Farewell. Go to the slaughterhouse. Okay. Sure. Just, just send me to the slaughterhouse. Cultists. I don't need that stuff. I need ghosts and golems. That's a golem, right? Yes. Needs to be a corpse first, though. There we go. We don't need no water. Let the mother beep burn. Burn, mother beep burn. So how do we get in there? Oh. At the entrance, of course. Hello. Aha, I've brought my own group with me. Well, Banshee, what say you? I think he meant to say charge, but okay. Okay, she's dead. And he's dancing on the tables. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm happy that you're happy. What's on your mind? We saved you. We did a nice medallion for that, but we can't use it because we have a better medallion. Ah! Um, what else? Hey the Plaguewood Tower. See you around. Transport a parcel, let's repair our items first and sell some of this junk. Um, then sell everything we don't need. I actually want to have these gauntlets. Um, can I open up the... Nope, I can't right now. Let's see. Have a good one. Hello? Keys? There we go. Just gauntlets out. Okay. You need something? We don't need all of this stuff. We'll just sell it. I don't plan to do anything with that stuff ever, so... There's no point in keeping it. I can't sell this. There we go. 
Ah, empty inventory. Perfect. For the alliance. Yes, for the alliance. Um, so how do we get out of this thing again? Hello? Like they teleport you inside, but they don't tell you how to get outside again. Hello? No? Maybe this way? <laughs> Dancing around and buffing people. <laughs> Okay. Let us go to the Plaguewood Tower then. Because all this other stuff. Skulls, towers, and what's that? It's free. Yeah. Journey's End. I don't know. That's not what we need to do right now. We need to kill these guys first. Light the corpse on fire. Can I free a spirit by killing a cannibal ghoul, maybe? Yep, we can. Ta-da! Your soul is free! Go forth into the light, brave warrior. Oh, there's another one. Which means that's another one. Now we're starting to make progress, that's perfect. We hit him. Get him. Okay, so these guys give skulls, but they don't give souls. Okay. Okay. Golems don't have souls. Only the, only the mindless undead have souls. Got it. So these gargos don't do anything for me as well. Let's get this guy. Come on. See, if you want them to add, they don't. A nice fire. Aha, these guys we do want. No, I got them. I can't still burn him. Ha 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 ha. Walk warriors. <laughs> it's only one way to play a warrior, and it is human or gnome. Or goblin. Hello. Hello. Need to get Rudberry's disembodied arms and one fleshy giant foot scrapings. No one. Okay. Beware. Um. <laughs> Okay, things just got weirder. Cursed mage. Yeah, he's got a skull. Uh, ex excuse me, good sir. I will I will have to relieve you of your skull. Thank you kindly for that donation. Mm, there's more cannibal ghoul. We take him. We go over to the cursed mage. Where do I get those berries? Hmm. One more golem after this, and at least this part of the quest is over. Oh, 
Oh, there's berry bushes, I think. So, there's one, yeah, that's a red bush berry. A uh, red berry bush. Who has red berries? Okay. The red berry bush has red berries. Your berries are very rotten to the core. You may fire when berry ready. Perfect, that gives us... It's a good thing I didn't hunt all these mobs beforehand. Otherwise I would have wasted all this... Uh, all these items. I would have, come, have to come here again and... Uh, basically do the quest twice. So we got the berries, that's good. What else do we need? Disembodied arms and we need to get the... Uh, Scrapings, okay. I still need skulls. For my skull throne. And later on in the game we will, yes, we will indeed need blood for the blood god. Bergahoon! So to free two more spirits after this one. And we are level 52. A new skills. Nope, 55. Deep, oh, deep wounds at 55. We probably won't do this in this uh, in this video, but in the next video for sure. That's gonna be nice. That's only three levels off. Oops, hell, I forgot something. Burn. Almost spirit to free. Let's get some disembodied arms, but where do we... Who's got disembodied arms? They're just lying around here. You're kidding, right? Nope, for real. There's disembodied arms lying around. <laughs> okay, well, I'm searching for arms now. Tainted mind, intellect reduced. Okay, well, that's okay. I'm a warrior, I don't need intellect. I don't need to be smart, I just need to hit things very hard. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, getting tired for some reason. Let's get some more coffee. Unfortunately, the coffee is cold by now. I really should get one of these USB cup warmers. But yep, I kid you not, that is a thing. On the other side of things, cold coffee also makes you awake. Come on, I need- Whoa, there's an arm. They're a little bit hard to see sometimes. arms around here. Hello? Has, has anybody lost an arm by any chance? So would you mind terribly if I took it? Hello? Any arms around here? Yes! One more! One more arm and I will have all the arms I will ever need. Which is exactly five. Ah, not into the water. No! No! Doggy doesn't like water. Too cold for him. He prefers it molten and lava -y. Um, so yeah. Arms. One more. Um. Well, at least we got one more skull while we're at it. Ooh, we got a big healing potion, finally. A major healing potion. Very good. Now, back to the arms business. <laughs> TTP, what are you doing? Well, I am an arms dealer. <laughs> Which means I deal in arms. <laughs> it's so stupid. I'm an arms dealer. <laughs> yeah, I'm collecting arms. <laughs> 
Oh, oh god. Okay, we still need to get more stinking skulls from skeletons, but... Let's get some toenail clippings for... First, or giant foot scrapings from... Uh, the foot. Okay, sure. And there is a, another skull waiting for me. One more skull for my skull throne! I probably don't want to sit on the skull throne afterwards because those are stinking skulls. I don't know about you guys, but I prefer my skulls bleached and clean. Not stinking. One more. How big is that area, by the way? Oh, it's actually pretty big, so we can actually go back there to just a little touched. And turn them in there as well. And turn in this quest while we're at it as well. Maybe get a follow-up. What is it? Here you go. Um Yeah, sure, just just a good mace. That's not a mace, that's a wooden hammer. Okay, let's just get the the flesh giant Victory touring. For Sylvanas. Victory for Sylvanas? I think not. Terrordale. That's a nice name for a town. Where do you live? Oh, I live in Terrordale. Okay. It's Terrordale and I'm gonna bring the Baneling. I like their style. Cursed mages are cool. Oh, and there is our friend, Egan. Maybe is- are you our friend? And Augustus the Touched. Speak quickly. Who's wearing a turban. And looks like he came right off an SM dungeon. We need to kill Tell plagued you know. swines and get his receipt book. Goodbye. Okay. Oh, he's just slightly creepy. Die, swine! Wow, that was a nice war breaker. Almost one hit the guy. That was nice. Uh, we need to kill nine more swines. Have at the swine. Um, is that the inn? Oh, the inn is probably the other room. Um, the other thing. This is the inn. So let's go in there. Let's go in to the inn. And uh, find his receipt book. Maybe upstairs? This is creepy. Hello. Ah, there it is. Oh, time to kill some more swines. I'm already guessing that there's not that many swines around here. Have at thee. Have at thee. Come on, little Baneling. Bomb him. I think the Baneling is a... Uh... He doesn't want to go ahead and uh, be a real baneling. Why, can't, why is there no path available? Don't tell me that. I'm not interested in excuses. Four more. There's luck will have it. There's exactly two more here. It's the last one. Get over here, you swine. Boom. And that is all the rest of the XP gone. Sad face. There you go, good sir. So these two quests, let's see, 22% was the level we were at before. And now... 35, so that gave 10% plus 3. 
aka 13% of our level. So one quest gives us about 6 or 7% of our level. That's not too bad. That means we have to do about 10 quests plus normal killer XP for one level up. I still need more skulls. I need two more skulls for my stinking skull throne. Where I shall reside. And sit in court. Oh, okay. That was the wrong kind of undead to kill. Oh, TTB. You're getting old. That's also the wrong kind of undead. I need a very specific kind of undead. One that has a skull. This guy. Back in Classic, you always knew when people were leveling in Eastern Plaguelands, because they always had this stupid body curse on them. <laughs> There we go. We got the skulls for my skull throne of stinking proportions. Very nice. What can I do for you? Oh, scourged mass. Vendors of Dyrshire. And the stinking skulls. Cloak of hoarding, alright. Destroy hulks of three corpse beasts by placing three or more age Argent Light Wells next to them. Okay. See you around. Okay, I can do that. Need to kill those big ass uh, thingies. <laughs> There's one of them. Oh wow, these are big. So, I need to kill the reanimators first because, well, you guessed it, otherwise they will be reanimated. Ah, but I can actually spread the stuff of sweeping strikes, of course. That's what I thought. That's good. So, you can't place them within 10 yards of each other, right? So, it's one, it's two. Come on, that's 10 yards, right? And free. Boom. He's dead. Um, let's get the next one. Ten yards is not that much of an area. Let's see if we can actually get away with just placing one, uh, killing one guy. That's one. And no, we won't because this guy is placed in such a way that it won't do us any good. So 10 yards, let's see. Ten, this this should be 10 yards. Easily. Less than 10 yards, actually. This should be 10 yards. Nope. Now. Done. Hello. Destroy this, please. What's going on here? Why are you not casting? Hmm. Apparently it wants to bug out now. That's okay. I'll just place a few more. Place this here. That's working. This here. Nope. Maybe here. I can't place in combat, right? That was it. Now we're done. Okay. Back to the other area with Stumpy Mac Stumps a lot. Oh, I could actually summon the Sister of Temptation. Hmm. 
Stop casting at me. Okay, and that should be it here. Hello, Crusader. Be careful. That's it. Okay. Back to Light's Hope Chapel. 52, almost 53. Now we need to talk to Fiona. Is thou there at her cart, of course? I offer service with a smile. The only honest merchants are Gilnean merchants. Okay, done with that. So, as I said, next stop. GTL, friend. Badlands. Tinkering. Laundry. Off to the Badlands. She's very far away. Do you want to board? Yeah, sure. Off, off, and away. On Viridian Flames, we fly. I really hope this thing actually teleports and not really flies all the way down to the Badlands. Please don't tell me this thing flies for 10 minutes. That would make me very sad indeed. Because the Badlands, we're, we're up here, the Badlands... Actually, where are we flying? Badlands. Maybe I mistook that. Maybe the Badlands and the Blasted Lands are a different thing. Are these the Badlands? Oh, these are the Hinterlands. Hmm. Oh, it's over there. Eastern Kingdoms, it says. Oh, so these are the Badlands. Okay. Uh, which is right at Burning Steps. Didn't do much questing there, so I don't remember much of that, but um, yeah, so we're, we're, we're flying there now. Um, it's gonna take a little while. They could easily have just made that uh, a teleportation spell, but... Uh, you know... Why make things that make sense? At least we get to enjoy the hinterlands, and then fly over Arati Highlands. Loch Modern. 
This used to be like a giant lake around here. So it has been drained since because they destroyed the dam over here. Oh, there was Nessie in here. <laughs> they actually had Nessie in Loch Modan, which was amazing. There's a path down towards Ironforge. And this... Are these the Badlands? Yes, these are the Badlands. This is a scar from uh, Deathwing. Deathwing Rage, the Fru. And we will reach the Badlands, actually. Wow, that's... Oh, <laughs> I'm getting goosebumps. That sea looks amazing. Of course, this is also part of the Twilight Headlands, uh, which is an 84 level zone. It's a little bit higher in level. So we won't be going there. We shall land over here. Infuse light by the sea. Alrighty. Yo! Gadget sand, of course. Be good! Okay. Is there anything we can do here? Quality explosions. Interesting. There should be a teleporter here somewhere. In the back of Fuse Lab by the Sea. Okay, let's try and find that teleporter. Is that a an auction house or something in here? Great Pisani. No, he's a mayor. And the warden is here. And Nick the Mountain from Gadget Sun, who has Thunder Fury on his back. Interesting. It's nice music. Where's the teleporter? Oh, over there, of course. You. Uh, now we're on top of the mountain and need to report to this dude. I like how they made all these little lights here so you actually know where to go. <laughs> That's cool. So yeah, I was thinking blasted lands, but since I have never really leveled bad lands, at least not consciously, <laughs> I don't remember leveling bad lands ever. Uh, this is gonna be nice. It's gonna be a new zone to explore. Got a lot of verticality to it. <laughs> Signposts are amazing. Uh, goblins and gnomes. Just gotta love them. No, leave me alone. Red stalker, go away. Go, go bite somebody else. Not me, though. All right, new quest up. Perfect. Time is money, friend. Need to Have kill ogres. One. We can do that. Time what else? Money, need to get an instructor's Be rod good. from an ogre mage, and we need to get the flight point. Oh, we already have it. Okay. Hmm. Good. So let's go kill some ogres. Uh, detour. Okay. Now we need to dust wind gulch. Okay. And there is an initiate. Okay. I need to get I need to get uh, something from Whoa, what? You cannot interrupt ogres by That's weird. Couldn't interrupt that first cast. You saw that the uh, the cast ball was red, right? That is decidedly weird. Um There's an ogre mage. Whoa! <laughs> damage from them. Oh, right, because it's just casting at the wall. That's why I can't interrupt it. Because it's not really casting it at you. Oh, good. I wonder how these ogres get their second head. I wonder if they're born with it or if they have to, like, evolve it somehow. Well, evolve doesn't make sense, but grow it somehow. Maybe before they become mages. Maybe they have a transplant on them. Like a weird experiment. I don't know. Don't ask me. I just see ogres with one head and ogres with two heads, and I wonder. Wonder how. I wonder what. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I get it. I should not sing. I know. Just tr trust me. I know. <laughs> Bring more of these guys. Just want to get that last quest done. And then we can sit back. And accumulate some more rested XP. It's 
that's it. We can go back now. <laughs> this looks weird. Nudge Billy Goats, okay. Boom. <laughs> that's not nudging. Gently nudge a Billy Goat off the edge of loose light. Yeah, yeah, that's not nudging, that's literally catapults! <laughs> that's fun. And the cool thing is you can even stay on your horsey. So, poof. And poof goes the weasel. I love it. I don't realize I say poof goes the weasel, no pop goes the weasel. Trust me, there's a reason for that. Boom. Boom, I say. <laughs> this is fun. Boom. Ready, set, go. In under one minute? <laughs> Got an achievement for that. <laughs> okay. Hey, how you doing? Complete quest. Boom. There we go. Level up. Level 53. Perfect. There's a barmaid, so this is probably an inn. No, it's not an inn. Okay, let's try that one again. Maybe that big building is an inn. Both of these could be an inn. Um, let's see. Just so I can go and sit down and get my rest XP bonus. Um, this ain't one. Just need to find a place to log out. Oh, well, that has been a nice run. We did uh, six levels in total in under three hours. That's good. That is rest XP zone if I'm not one. Yep, perfect. And so. As always, thank you guys for watching wherever you are on this planet. Have a great day, and I shall be seeing you soon with a new episode once the Reset Bonus is back up again. TGB out!